Yo, 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 welcome to another episode of After Class, everybody. Thank you so much to the people that have been watching and listening to all three of our crazy asses, bitch. Um, like I said, we're in the process of upgrading where we're filming and upgrading our equipment. So just stick with us. What y'all laughing about? The whole time you're talking, she's like, Hey, they be mad at us when we talk over oh, us, so, over each other, so they we can't be mad. doing that. I saw that. I we saw can't that. be doing that. They're like, y'all not a real podcast. Y'all don't be taking this shit seriously because you guys cannot yeah. be talking it's not over. It's a real podcast. <laughs> right. We, just we already shit. said this. Get up production, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> we sell, we are self-made. We just have the conversation. This we what we keep. Keep. We're using like our resources. Y'all want it to be real or y'all want it to be not? <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, back, back to the intro. Back to the intro. Okay. Um, you know we got Ali up in the building say what's up. Hey. We got Ari up in the building say what's up. Hey. We got Jazz up in the building say hey, what's, what's up. up. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, right we got some, I love that part. Yes, you know, we got we got a little bit of things that we want to touch on mm. today. Um, maybe a moment of silence for Breonna Taylor. I know I, it's so crazy how everything was just so so on Black Lives Matter and all of this and everything was coming to light and I think we were on to, we were on such a good path with yeah. everybody being on the same page and like spreading the awareness. Yeah. And then obviously life happens and I think like we kinda, I even, like I'm even so guilty of wanting to go back to, to normal, what life was. Yeah. Especially because we all, you guys have to understand, we all use our social media to make a living. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? And I will never, ever, ever, like, justify using my social media that's because okay. that's what I, because that's what I use. Bitch, why was I, I'm pause so this, sorry, pause was this serious conversation. Why was I in the car, uh, had an inkling t of itching, a and an uh, inkling, inkling, I had an inkling to itch or whatever, like, I felt it, so I was like, I'm and like, like bitch, my real hair, hair is up in this shit. Like, <laughs> I'm like, let me really scratch this. The, the second I took her weave out, she said, <laughs> in this bitch kitchen, like, you're like, please don't And then she was doing it, so I was like, damn, I just, let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> so we were both looking at each other, like, like right? I, hey, I want to smell what I smell. I want to smell that pheromone. I did not want to ruin that conversation, but this top track is really smooth. Already, bitch? bitch? You gotta yeah. tap, 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 tap. tap Use tap, that hard tap, part. Tap, tap. Okay. <laughs> um, sorry. Okay. okay. Run it back. Wow. Run it back. Run it back. So sorry. Anyway, um, so Brianna Taylor, uh, what is going on with her right now? I think her her uh, what you call it? Killers were acquitted or something. Yes. Do you guys know the extent of that? Um, I just know that they were given a twelve million dollar settlement, which oh, the family. The family and. They only got in trouble for shooting the, neighbor the neighbor's house, which doesn't make any sense. That doesn't mm -hmm. make any sense. So mm -hmm. that's that's the only thing that they that they got in trouble for, and it's just it's just very unfortunate because it's like even even the twelve million dollars. It's like thank you, but well, that's not that, gonna bring my daughter back. My daughter back. It's I not mean, gonna change well, the world. And, right, what is going I mean, to change? change the world. Exactly, and that's the thing. It's like, make okay, the change. Well, well, you know, putting these officers in, in prison is not gonna bring their daughter back either. That nothing's gonna bring their daughter back. But right. At least it's the lack of accountability. But it's, right. And it, right. And at least, at least by you know giving her justice, that's that's the start of a. Of a, people of only want to make and examples out of black people. People, 100. percent a, a black killer, a black murderer. You want to make the example out of them, and you're gonna go to jail. You're gonna get this. So if you can give me 12 million dollars million to acknowledge what you a did was wrongful, wrong, but wrong. then not actually. So it's like, was it wrong or was it wrong or was it not? You know, mm -hmm. what I'm saying? it's you're like that. That's giving the, anybody any that's the question. What was wrong? That's the question. Mm -hmm. You won't pay me out for your wrongful shit. 12 yeah. million dollars, like 12 mil. And I'm sorry, y'all can go to jail for that. Y'all can go to jail for that. Right. Yeah, they would probably rather have that. I mean, $12 million, let's face it, is a lot, of, a lot money, of money. But just for what this situation is, I pr I'm pretty sure they would rather see those killers locked up for motherfucking life, not drawing breath, yeah. than have this $12 million. Has her family spoken out yet? Do you guys know? Have they said anything? I know I saw a cousin or something. Something spoke out. But I'm just curious. I'm just, like, really curious to see what her 
family has to say just about, about I don't even know if I would be able to about speak all bitch. I, I, no, wouldn't, I wouldn't be too either because they'll would. probably turn turn it turn everything around yeah. like I just I think for the people who are watching I I just don't believe everything that you see on the media like I realize social dilemma if you guys have never seen that um, what is it is a, a documentary on yeah, Netflix, Netflix called social dilemma and you can kind of just get a little taste of what is behind all of the social media. Like people, people with the, all the power and all the money in the world, they are making you see what they want you to see on the media and computers 100%. and ads and all of that. They can feed anything to you guys' brains and you're believing all that shit when that might not even be the real thing. It's an agenda. It's so an please, agenda. It's, yeah, it's an agenda, y'all. It's all a fucking business. It just, is all a business. Because all they talked about was the money. They didn't really yeah. talk about anything else. Just do your pride. Exactly. Just do yeah, it. they want to make us feel better. Like, okay, they got money. Yeah, okay, right. they're set for life. But no, no, bitch. What is the bigger picture? We need to start looking at the bigger picture. 100%. And just do your, my, my biggest thing is do your research. Like, don't make decisions. Don't off make, of don't make decisions off of, yeah, social media and what Make people and what people repost. You know what I'm saying? It's like so many people. Do you know how many times I have seen people repost quote unquote facts from somebody else and it's not a fact? Just dead the fuck wrong. Like just so wrong. Like you, you. The just, term educate just yourself stop. holds so, so it's no much longer money. an insult. It's yes. no longer, like educate it's yourself. It's like please like, you educate yourself it. because you're you're passing along information that is not true. One. And you're, you're thinking mm. people, are, people are having full blown arguments back and forth with people. And I'm like, you don't even, you don't even, really you don't even know what's up. And if you don't know what's up, then, then just keep quiet. Just then keep, keep quiet, quiet or do your research. Like people uh, and hey, I, I, as much as I'm on social media during the day, like I kind of have to remind myself like, yeah. bitch, this shit may not even be like, no. I, I, oh my God, do you guys remember that black and white picture thing? Like all women were posting black yes. and white pictures. Black and, white and pictures. it was, I think y'all know this, if you're listening, like the black and white picture we thought when it when it got to us. 100%. By this point, well, you know, like, catch, like I'm a black woman, yeah. I just, uh, no, not no, that one. Not it was just one. like women empowerment, women like yeah. women appreciation. Send this oh, to the people oh, that you feel you like. Yeah, I okay, did. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Little did I know, I didn't even know where that challenge came from. How it did the challenge point. even come about? And it was about remembering all of like the women that have been wronged. I think somewhere it, in it Turkey, was, like oh, yeah, it was another Turkey. country. Yeah, we're here, we're here. And we're the all black and white. Like, just passing it over like, I'm a woman, appreciate Be it. I girl. have never felt so dumb. Like, the black just, and white had represented seeing them after they had passed away in the newspaper, reading about them. And here, and, realize, and here we are posting our motherfucking selfies, half naked half and shit. Naked, talking about some woman appreciation. It's like, Damn, that's exactly. I'm like, I wish I would have done the research, but we're so locked wow. into what's wow. happening on that's social media true. that we're just like following everybody's doing and like we hopping on the thing. Damn. Like I gotta remind myself because I have never shit. felt so dumb As before. Funny, Really hears like that is real shit. Granted, phone, like, yeah. Granted, I thought I was doing a good thing. I'm like, okay. bitch, I'm sending this to all my friends. Which, which it still was pure intention. It still was a good thing. Like at least, at least that was a situation where you know it was both were. That was a positive, positive outcome. So but that just goes to prove, that. yeah, like, and that just goes to, to prove the point that it's like people really don't know what they're talking about on social media. It's just everybody's just following each other and following each other, and it's like. You don't even know where that came from. Like, I don't know if that's a fact. I don't know if this is if this is not true. And mm -mm. It, it just and people come for you. Like people come mm -mm. for you so hard. Well, you didn't post this, and why did you say this? And mm -mm. then I'm like, well, I didn't post that because it's not true. Mm -hmm. I didn't post that because I did my research. You're like, it's just shit out of ignorance. I, just, it, to it, say just I just did it. Like, I did mm. it like you guys. Like, mm. no. Like, they it, look for influencers to do all to these do all things, of these things. But, like, when half of the people. Mm, so anyway, so anyway, going back to uh, Brianna, you know, and I know this is a very sensitive subject, so I'm going to I'm going to respectfully move on. But before we move on, we're going to really, really send out our prayers and shed light on this situation. And we want everybody to do their research because we probably don't even know the full extent. Like there's so many layers when it comes to this. But, you know, we she's weighing heavy on our hearts today. And um, and we just want to 
you know, send our prayers and send love to the family and Breonna Taylor, rest in peace. And just to all black women who feel like, who feel unprotected unprotected and unappreciated. Yeah. Let us be the let us be, you know what I mean, representation of all black women. Cause I think we have like, you know, yeah. throughout throughout Queens and Lettos, we have all shades, we have yeah. all cultures, we have everything. Yeah. And we're rep- we are all one right. when we're, you Absolutely. know what I'm saying here in the dance floor. So we are Absolutely. all representation and we gotta do it for them. Yeah. So sending love to sending love. the black brown skin girl today. Yes. Yeah. Brown skin girl, gang, gang, skin just like pearl, gang, gang. <laughs> anyway, okay, moving yeah. on to um, our next subject. Well, I want, I want a true opinion yes. from the both of you guys as my motherfucking friends. Okay. You gonna I, say what I think you're going to say? I'm already irritated. What? Go ahead. No, it's not. Oh, okay, we can move we on can to go, there. We can go there. We had talked about P-Valley. We had talked about P-Valley, I think, episode two. Episode two or three. And I just told them that I finished that shit, and I didn't like it. I'm so sorry. Mm. You know what? I, what I do like, see, I'm a believer of having a negative and a positive. You know, like when you're correcting somebody's paper in in, um, school or whatever, and they're like, you know, make sure to give them a positive, positive then give them a negative and a a critique. So here's the positive. I love, bitch, it makes me want to pole dance. It, was, it makes me want to pole dance like shit. The talent that was there was amazing mm-hmm. to kind of show what a stripper's life is and like what they have to do. It's much more than just showing you guys' body. Like if you're out there, if, whoever's listening and watching, if you're a stripper, kudos to yeah, you. You're the one. Yo, okay. kudos you're the one. to you. We don't know what be going on in you guys' lives. I know you guys are probably the most hardest workers, you know what Hell I mean, yeah. in the entertainment shit. business. Hell yeah. And um, and you're beautiful and you're talented as That's shit. Yeah. Like people be going crazy over what we do in our it's heels, like, even though it is like a challenge. But yeah, bitch, I'm not motherfucking pole. Holding your fucking Yo, the pl- uh, I was so scared. Yeah. Just no core. Don't y'all be sore? Just no core. I could imagine y'all soreness after okay. after a motherfucking night, bitch. Okay. Um, what did you not like about it? I'm interested. The negativity, I mean, the negative is because, okay, so I am a fiance of a fellow actor, a director. Tally is all about like, what is the storyline and how is, and is it something that we haven't seen before? How creative were they? Like the storyline. So yes, okay. we have a girl, she has a past. She, we have glimpses of the past and we're like, damn, what is it? So it makes you keep watching. Watch. Okay, cool. I like that part. But then once when I found out what it really was and it was like, okay, this girl stole money from her man or something like that. And then the man shot at her. Uh, he, he turned out to be an abusive partner or something like that. They had a daughter or something. You know what I mean? And granted, yes, it, it just wasn't like, whoa. It, was it didn't blow typical. my mind. It was typical. typical. There it is. That's valid. I think it was, I think the, the only negative is that I think everybody's storylines was typical. And then we have the bomb ass stripper who's trying to get out of the business, start her right. own thing, have a gym. She was a teacher. I like that. So it's like, I think the storylines were just mediocre. Mediocre. I for an amazing season two to see character. De- I'm going to defend this to the death of the beach. Um, with my non acting directed ass. Okay. Uh, subpar. Okay. Yeah. I think that it set it up for a great um, uh, season two to see character development. Because okay. Because Miss Autumn walked in with all white and a busted eye talking about I'm going to buy the pink. You ain't think that when she stepped up in the club. You ain't see that boss ass bitch <laughs> when she first started. <laughs> and then Thrill. you ain't see Mercedes start to humble herself and shit and be this nice bitch. Because she was. it's just like a lot of dynamics. <laughs> and I really She's think so mad. Mad. She's so She's mad, so mad, mad y'all. Yeah. you that we had to wait because we was going to get active, Aaliyah Janelle. <laughs> just because she wants to be on the show. She doesn't really feel that way. (laughs) (laughs) No, but I love the show. (laughs) You know she only feels this way because she wants to be on the show. Um, 
because I appreciate the show. You didn't I pay mean, attention. To the run about. <laughs> We're gonna watch the show together. I clearly need to point out the details that you missed. That you thought were mediocre. So okay. <laughs> I mean, Ooh. It, it, is a, it is a good show. I like the simplicity. There you go. Show. Your fucking fan page is going to post this part yeah. right here. Right. You're going to be looking cray right. cray. They're going to be like, not booking you. Right. <laughs> Director is like, she's too wild. Like she's you know, no, actually, I'll that's perfect. You need a character <laughs> like me. <laughs> I like Keyshawn, though. What's her name? Keyshawn? Key. Key. Oh, I said who? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I was she, like, yeah, maybe I did watch the show. I hate Mississippi. y'all, Mississippi. Miss, she can call her by her stage name. Who is Keyshawn? Am I quick and let it Wait, let it out. Wait, let's come correct and keep her it cute. It's Mississippi. Yeah, yeah they call her Key or something like Key, that. Okay. Key or something. You know who's funny. I know her real name. Diamond. Okay. I already knew you were going to say that. Because I saw him at the gas station the other day, but I looked so dusty, crusty, like a wet shower mat. Mm -hmm. Just hair, like, and I smelled like bounce that ass and a can of beans. Ew, and I was jazz. Like, it was not like booty sweat. Okay. Oof. Girl, I was so crusty, dusty, and it was just me and him at the gas station. He probably like you like that. I pulled up, I said, oh, you're like, fuck, can't even speak. Just wop, wop, wop. <laughs> just wop, <laughs> wop. And I was like, dang. I should say something. But didn't. But nope. didn't. And I, I know I was looking dumb, because I was like. <laughs> <laughs> and he was, he just pulled up with his little Mercedes P Valley. So you said, good, huh? you, right? Right, that P Valley, right, that P Valley money. He is cute. He is cute. I yeah, wish. He's very cute. Never mind. I'm not even gonna say more. All the time. Mm -hmm. I'm drive 30 minutes to the gas right, you must live nearby. <laughs> okay. You must live so nearby. So that's the thing. I don't want y'all going crazy or in the comments, no, which no, you guys no. probably will. But the only the negative is not even that negative. Like it was very entertaining, and I think that's what I look for in the shows. Like, is it entertaining? Is like, what's the um. I like, the t I like talent. I'm biased because I'm a dancer, so I'm like, if right. there's going to be dancing, okay. if there's going to be some form of art, <laughs> I want to make sure y'all are like, you know what I mean? So yeah, anyway, it's just a little tip. It's that's, a little tip tip. It's a valid. little tip tip. That's valid. Hmm, that's valid. It's not. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Moving on. Speaking of Netflix show, we weren't talking about this before, but I just thought about it. Oh, God. Have you fucking seen Cuties? Cuties? Oh Lord, no! What Have is this? Seen, okay, well let me just. You guys, y'all probably know. So, it's Cuties. a terrible, terrible show. I mean, movie. People were telling us to watch People, it. People, yeah, it's a terrible, it's a terrible movie. Okay. Okay. Um, and is Netflix, that trending now? She. Yeah. yeah, it was oh, that's number trending? one. It was number one in the United States. Okay. It's fucked up. So Netflix, <laughs> Netflix, there was a petition out to like cancel Netflix. Basically, this show. First of oh all, the Lord. timing. The timing of it is is a little smart, though. Very smart. But the timing. Yeah, you know, it, everything is planned, y'all. Yeah. The, the timing of it is a little fucked up because of all this pedophilia shit that's going on. Oh yeah. So it's about these four girls who are children. It's a movie. It's a yeah. movie. I did not watch the entire thing because I refused. But I was I was skipping through to see what people were talking about. Have you seen it? Yeah. Okay. To see what people <laughs> were talking about. Yeah, a little bit. Um, basically, it is about these four young girls who want to be dancers, but the kind of dancing that they're doing, and when I mean young, Aaliyah, I'm talking like... Talking Oops, she like, used my first name. I'm this is serious, bitch. I'm talking about like 11, 12, 13, yeah. Now... <clears throat> what type of dancing? Now, oh. Yeah. You think there was I'm a fucking, scene, there was a scene where she was like... Up. Yeah. And the facial. Grown-ass men producers watching this fucking... Watching them fucking do this shit. It's based Booking off a true story? Them. Girl, look what we do in real life in these little competitions. It's like little, to shed light on competition world and so like little girls who do shit like the this point, on the floor. Like. The point is, the po now I understand the intent. I will say I do understand the intent because what it was about is this young black girl who was from like an African, Af like they, the cult, their culture was just very like conservative. conservative. Yes. And so she goes to this school, meets these girls. She wants to be this, this like wonderful dancer, whatever, whatever. By the end of it, she's on stage, like humping the floor, doing all of this, and then she has like an awakening, and she like stands up and starts crying, one, runs home, and like hugs her mom and grandma, and basically, basically that was the point. It was like, this she's, she's moving too fast, this is not good, blah, 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 blah. <clears throat> but that is not my problem. The problem is, I know the people who were filming, the people who were there are all nothing but old, exactly, exactly. And, and like. I'm, I'm talking about 
they are in cut shorts, yeah. bra top, on stage, like humping the floor. Like, on what stage? It's, it's, the, it's, it's a strip. It's a movie. Like they're doing it's a, yeah, it's a show. Oh. Like it's a, they're on a competition stage, and there's judges just watching them while they're literally on stage. Like, yeah, bitch. So it was a huge thing, which is why it was trending on Netflix because everybody was like, "What, what the, the fuck? fuck is going on?" And it was now. It was in. It's a French movie, so it's. Out of, it's but they're a little different. They're a little different over there, mm -hmm. but that's not the point. Why the hell would you put this on Netflix? And on top of that, Netflix already knew that they were fucking wrong because the cover photo before they changed it was the children in like a pose and then people complained and, and they, they changed, changed the cover it. photo. So you knew that you were wrong. So why didn't you just take it off? It also came out that for six months they had like we're, for six months, they were watching audition tapes of little girls of twerking, little girls and, twerking and, and, and it's like, what the fuck was you doing come for on, six bro. months? And where come the fuck on. is that footage? Where is it? That's what I'm talking about. Too. You need to go fall in a ditch, too. Exactly. Because what and the, the timing, the timing is just too... Mm. Nasty. It's disgusting. Oh, yeah, go shit. Watch it. It's, it's on, it's, it's, it's it's on Netflix. And I mean, skip through. Like, obviously skip through. The main... Okay, well, w were they trying to say something? Yes. Like, what is the... What is... What was the conclusion? What are we... I mean, what as, are what really as viewers are we... What are we I supposed mean, to learn? I mean, What's the, the, the lesson? I understand Over the sexual Because, bitch, girls. we be putting that shit yeah. out. Right, but we're, we're grown, grown women. women. Right, that's right. That's the problem. The and, and half of the time, they were doing some shit sometimes that I'm like... I don't even like doing that. Do I even like? Do I even feel comfortable putting that out? Like, right. Do I even feel comfortable looking like that? And this is this is literally an eleven, however the fuck old girl humping the floor and touching her vagina and, and sucking on her her finger. Like I was a competition kid though, so I, I saw like yes, I, I, I me fast too. forward a little bit. Right. So there, it's more so like over sexualizing little girls, little girls. having them move too fast and mm -hmm. releasing. So there is. I understand, but right. you didn't have to do it like that. There's other to ways to like shed that. light on it. Like. It, One it, thing I saw though is like we had dance moms for ten years and these girls are doing the same things and there was not. As yeah, where were their parents? I'm where sorry, where are their parents? That's what that's I was watching. Where are their like, parents I was at? Not as exactly. big of an I was watching because, this interview mm -hmm. and that's what the guy said. The guy was like, "Look, okay, the kids. Who's fine, ever? But you yeah. want you? This goes back to the same shit. You want your child to be booked so bad. You want your child mm. to be a star so bad that you're, that you're like, pussy. do whatever you want. Oh yeah, you can go stay with this. Court there actor, it is. Or you can go stay with this actor, or you can do these things because there I want my it to be is. A star. That's the motherfucking. That's that the is problem. the root right there. Because the I just want to be careful. Because I'm like, yeah, because little girls follow us. I'm I'm yeah. so sure. 10, 11, 100%. you know that all of that. And number one, I try to make sure that whatever we put out and whatever our routine is, is yes, it's sexy because let's not get it twisted. Being sexy is okay. Being yes, proud of our body it's is powering. okay. 100%. You know what I'm saying? Wanting to, wanting to show it and wanting, wanting to express it in our way is okay. 100%. However, we are experienced. We have our own lives. We make our grown. own money. We are grown. We don't answer to anybody. We know what respect is. But it's when a we, conscious awareness it's of what of we're what doing we're and doing. understanding what we're putting out and yes. how we're portraying ourselves. Yes. That is it. And, and then on the other side, right? yes. Then, but then, then on the really other is. side, the viewership, who is viewing this, like, I'm going to be, I'm going to be so on my children and what they're watching, Absolutely. what are they putting into their brains, Absolutely. who their freaking idol is, who, 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 who they're idolizing, you know what 100%, I mean? 100%. Who they're being influenced by. So I'm like, so when I hear that, I'm like, well, damn, we be doing all that shit. Yeah, so which, are we part of the problem? Um, are heels dancers are, are like, not dancer, not heels dancers, but I mean, most, let's be honest, like the people who I dance in so. heels, we, ex we are right. the ones that express our right. sensuality 100%. to the world. 100%. But and these girls are watching us. Yeah. I think there's a fine line because there is at, a fine at some line. point they are watching us and they could be like, this is what I want to do. But That's think very about interesting. when we watch music videos. Right. We're looking at Beyonce, J-Lo, exactly. right. all those. Exactly. But there was still... It was tasteful. And, and my parents yes. were on me too, like, that's cute. Like, my dad came home and I swear I was 106 in park. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. Because you are 11, little girl. Exactly. And right. you will get popped in this motherfucker exactly. if right. I'm thinking in my living room. And that's my problem with it. That's my issue. It's like, yes, okay, there's going to be things that people look up to. It's, it's just like rappers, guys, little boys, what my little brother looks at, video games. There's right. all of those things that can have an influence on you. 
But there's a I think it starts with the motherfucking parents, though. Exactly. Because grounding. When grounding and discipline. Exactly. exactly. Maybe I loved watching these things. When I was a kid, I loved listening to Plies. I loved watching all of my turn now. What do you do now? Right. I'm a grown woman. I'm a grown woman. There is no reason that a, a table of three judges are like, wow. When four little girls are like, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? That's... That is so yeah, and the, unacceptable. Mm, like, yeah, and the so judges, like, why would you even be comfortable watching that? I mean, why even when I did competitions and shit, like, so, and I would be, like, on, on the judges' table and all that, they would be, like, I don't want to look don't at it. On the tapes, like. Yeah, I'll probably like, stop you with your first, within the, the first eight count. And all that, like, they're 12. They're 12, so. Eight, nine, why is their pussy lip dangling out? Or which brings me to this. Which brings me to this. This is the motherfucking trickery right here. We have... A twelve-year-old that comes to my class, which I thought about her I all did the too. time. I did too. I thought about all her. the time. I and I do have little girls. I do have girls of that age range coming to my class, wanting to She's wanting to do all of the things her. that we be doing. Hundred percent. So okay, but here's the, you've expressed multiple times, and, and you've even you've expressed to this girl's mother. And exactly. this is in no way us like trying to tell parents no how to mom. If a, if a parent is going to say okay, I'm not your mama. That's on you. That's it. That's your business. That's, your That's it right you there. You do make a good job, and you and you, you put do. out disclaimers. Sixteen and up, eighteen and up. We are going to be on the floor. You hear neighbors know my name. You know what the fuck going on, and exactly. you know what the fuck he talking about. Exactly. Mm. If, a, if a mother is saying okay. Then I'm not, and you're not, and you're not gonna tell a, a mother or father how to parent. No, their that's child. not your job. That's your business. That's and not your job. And if you're in the class, you give modifications. Right. You'd be like, ah, yeah. We finna hump the floor. You gonna give a wow, wow. Exactly. <laughs> right. Like, you're, 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 you're okay. Well, and you don't call. Okay. And you okay. Don't put her in. You don't in the promote forefront. Put her putting her in a video. Like, that's to, right. If we're, if we're dancing to like sit on his sit on his dick and do da 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 da, you're not putting you're not putting her in a video. Like you know what I'm saying? Like you're not you're not doing that. Yeah. I mean, because because that yeah, that's that's different. Okay, cause I'm because like that's, maybe that's we need to be wrong. a little bit more strict as to who's coming to my class and who you But my thing is but you can only there's so there's just so many fucking um, so many like just gray areas because I don't like people not being able to come to my class. Cause I know what, my class is fucking fun. I know people want to be a part of it. <laughs> you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm a fun ass bitch, yeah. 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 you know? Um, I do believe in modification. I do believe, of, I do believe making it work for, you know, that certain person right. with their age and all of that. Yeah, honestly, that's out of your control. And these girls are growing up so fast. Oh, and I just want to make sure that we are not part of the problem. Silver lining, when she 18, she's going to be booked. Yeah, okay. She's going to be booked, bitch. She she's like, I've been doing this, this okay? Okay. Yeah, oh, my God. She's going to be booked. <laughs> Next topic. Next topic. Next That's so topic. interesting. But anyway, look so at it. cuties. Watch it. Oof. Don't watch the whole thing. Just skip through. Just skip yeah, through probably, yeah. Because mm. it's it's very, 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 very unacceptable. Very unacceptable. Um... So I just released I just uh, released this video to hit different, hit different, hit different, hit different. Hit different. And um, a lot of people were complaining that it was too dark. I was mad. I see the comments. I was like, Ooh. they were they were pissed. It's okay, friend. I was ready to jump yeah. into the comments. Yeah, I mean, I was like, that's why I was like, no. So honest, so honest friends, did you guys think that it was a little dark? Y'all thought it was dark? It was definitely it was dark. dark, but I thought that was the point. Right. Yeah. But right. So then there's, but there's, so there's no problem with that. Like, if that was the point, then that looks great. So that's what people need to understand. Well, we have like, the eye to see. Yeah, that. that's what people need to understand. You have the art mind. Exactly. Yes. Like, John, you knew what I was trying to do. Yeah, it makes sense. It's a darker song. It was a sultry feel. And you wanted to feel you wanted to feel good not in a studio with a fucking white light. So, a big ass spot. Yeah. So about. I had I understood. Yeah. But I just thought that that was the point. So when I saw it, I was like, okay, cool. This is lit. I didn't realize that people would be so people offended. People would be so offended because yeah. that was the point. Like, yeah, yeah. You, know, you weren't tough. you weren't you weren't a goddamn so silhouette. Like, so I had that. so obviously I had I usually don't respond to negativity on my social media because I I kind of, I, I don't vibrate on that level because I know what I was trying to offer and I loved what I offered and I love, 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 love that video. Because the video was fire. Yeah, the shit Thank was fire. Thank you. Thank you. So lit. I just felt like I just needed to respond for, for people to see it with a different perspective. Like y'all need to, y'all need to know how to wear different lenses. Like it doesn't have to be just the this same one thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like we have different lenses like of seeing things yeah. and looking, yeah, looking at art for what it is yeah. and looking in between the lines 
So my question to you guys is when do you feel the need, when do you respond to your followers, whether it be from negativity or positivity? Because even on the other side of the other side of this, I get so many love emails and I just, or not love emails, but love DMs. And I just want to let y'all know who's ever listening and watching. Like we see that yeah, all the time and I we soak it that. in. Even if we don't respond, we see it and it's heard and it's received. 100%. But when do you guys respond? Let's start with negativity because I'm sure everybody wants to hear with that. How do you deal with that on your social media? When do you respond? I don't think I've ever responded. For real? I only responded to one boof ass nigga who was. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, there's gonna be one boof ass motherfucker because the video that we filmed outside after your shoot, yes, the one on the wall, the on the wall. His boof ass going DM me talking about you're never gonna find a man dancing like this. So I posted a different clip of my whole ass out. I said, well, well, guess I won't. How about this? Right. Okay, and, and, and it ain't right. you. <laughs> <laughs> back I was like damn LFO yeah I figured yeah I figured you're right and I was just joking about it but any like I don't really I'd be looking at it and like mm. like when we did um what the fuck did we do oh people came for me when we did when we they thought my pussy was dangling out when and we? I was like yeah oh this last time oh the second I was like, time yeah. when they thought my pussy lip was dangling out but it was for a dollar so all y'all need to cash at me and right, dollar. right. That video got like two hundred thousand views. <laughs> so two hundred thousand house off this pussy. Okay. <laughs> but things like that, like I just, I do internalize it. Y'all know I'm sensitive. They don't, they don't know the sensitive jazz. And right. I be crying. Mm -hmm. right. I do be crying. Um, but I just. So you didn't respond to that when they had commented. I, because then I was like. Because then what's going to get solved? What am I going to do yeah. from it? Someone else is going to find a way to justify it. Then they're going right. to be personally attacking me. That's exactly me. what it is. That's and exactly what it is. Y'all don't know Jasmine. Yeah. Y'all exactly. know Jazzy. Yeah. And yeah. We, don't, we don't need to take Jasmine there. Right. Like, even on the, the first episode, things were taken out of context. And I saw the comments on yep. your page oh, when they right. were trying to come for me. And I was like, that's right. why. That's, that's, just listen to yeah, it, and then you'll hear the context. It's exactly. not I'm saying I will never film you. Right. But, but you two minutes into the reason. class, yeah. when it's not time to film, I'm not going to film you. Yeah. yeah. And that's called dance it. etiquette. Yeah. And I'm one person. You've been said it. I yeah. say what I say and say with my chest and stand by it. 100%. Absolutely. And kidding. that's more. That's that's respectable right there. Yeah. I'm not. A you guys person. need to. That's when you need to be quiet because it's like. What can I say? Yeah. I'm not rude. I'm not malicious. And then no. I, just, I take things. I'm like, you know what? It comes with the territory. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, it comes. Now, I do make it a point to respond to positivity. Mm -hmm. I, I do. Yes. I'm not the best at it. And I, and that's yeah. more. So when, when I post things, like, I post and I literally put my phone down. Yeah. And I, I walk away because I cannot be, like, one like Monitoring. Like, like, yep. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Comment. Yeah. 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 And then uh -huh. you go look back and you got six likes. Because yeah. it was like this. Right. The whole thing. <laughs> Just not this. Mom. Not this. Not they this. liked it. Like, I can't. Yeah. yeah, but the DMs, I'm, I, I respond to the DMs. I do. I try to give my. It sounds weird that I have like a schedule for it, but I do like once a week. I'll try to like sit and, and assign like twenty That's minutes good. to go through and just be like. Thank I need you. to do that. But I also I feel weird. Like I feel like thank you is never enough. Like when when people pour their heart out, like someone was. It's like, a whole I yeah yeah. Like, yeah you can't just say thank you and, right. And I yes. Watch your videos and those, right. Those are rough. Is right. Thank you even enough? Like yeah, I don't think it is. It. So like those are things that keep me going because it'd be days where like bitch I'm You're not like, gonna post no videos. Don't this mm -hmm. ain't I'm not rocking with it. And be like I, you just make me smile. Mm. And there's no amount of thank you, you I yeah. appreciate it that will ever amount. To how that really makes me feel. So there is so much gratitude, and I try to do thank you with hearts and emojis. And I'm like, yeah. Does this sound fakey fake? Right. So I think that's sometimes where my hesitation comes from because I don't want to be like, she just brushed it off. Like, I love y'all. Yeah. And I really do appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, let this be our big yeah. message like, to all you, of you guys. You from the yeah. bottom of my heart. That's only that's how we keep going. That's it how does. we keep that's, that's how we only, keep inspired. You know what I mean? I is knowing so that you guys are watching and knowing that you guys care and knowing that it's doing something for you. Everything. Yeah. I not repost it all the time or things like that, but it's like Shout out to our fan pages. 100%. Okay, the fan page. Been, this fan page, bitch. <laughs> and I know you're watching this, so let me Right, see. yeah, tell her. <laughs> These crackhead videos have been making up these things. She was like, yup, taking that clip too. You make We them. was just watching it, bitch. 
You do it. These edits are so fire, y'all. Let you me, guys are, y'all are the ones. Let me see these fan y'all pages. Y'all are the ones. And I'd be looking at them. My mom follows it. She'd be looking at me like, like, Jasmine, can you come correct? Because you're embarrassing me. Okay. <laughs> you, you look crazy. Look and I am. It's I think videos. If you look I fuck with y'all because y'all really like That's how you do, though. That's how you do. Yeah. And they take the time out. They take the time out to make things like that. And I, I love it. I love so it. appreciate Shout out to Aaliyah it. underscore Janelle, Aaliyah Janelle official. I love you guys. Yes. You know, Aaliyah dot with. Like, and also. Like, Aaliyah well, Janelle well, underscore well. queen. Aaliyah Janelle FP. Um, yes, that's cool. You know, that's whatever. Lit. That's all that I see. But sis, I want to know. Yeah, y'all are so lit. Um, and we see y'all. And, resp- yeah. and we receive it. And, that, and then us doing something like this, our podcast, talking, you know, dancing, class, all of that. That's our way of giving saying thank back. you. Yeah, yeah, and giving back. Sis, when do you respond to negativity? Um, <laughs> I don't really respond. I don't really respond. I don't really respond because I don't have to. People do it for me. I was about to say that too. Uh, yes. The diehards I, will be. Oh my gosh. Ooh. People do yeah. it for me. Now, what yep. I do respond to is one, if somebody is being really, really nasty and coming for somebody that's trying to defend me, I will respond to you and I will destroy you. Like, that's one thing. <laughs> that's one thing about me. That is one thing. Yeah, you don't want that no confrontation with sis. Want, you, you do not, not want no con. You see them tattoos? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Looking like she came fresh out of jail. Okay. Oh, no. Shit. I, I, How long you was in? And this. <laughs> Bye. Wait, shut the fuck up. <laughs> and, but but that's the thing. It, it just I don't feel the need. I don't feel the need to. That's good. That's how you know that we vibrate so yeah, high if we don't feel the need to no, respond. No, because guess what? That's a you problem, not a me problem. Absolutely. You felt so strongly to comment on my shit. You, okay. You must, you must be having a bad day. Let me not. I'm going to just you. let you have it. But what you're not going to do is you're not going to just blatantly disrespect. And just shit on people, everybody else. People who are really trying to, to, look, that's fine. If you have your opinion of, oh, all her moves look the same. Or, oh, geek, geek, geek. You want to have that opinion? Trigger. Exactly. You want to have that opinion? The that's great. Trigger. I'm going to let you have that opinion. Then you don't need this to comment. This that every camera. Because she's even all Why'd you see that? Why'd you peep it? Okay. Gang, gang, and because you looked at every viewer. And yes, said, I did. And said, I see you. No, that's but that's big, that's real, that's big facts. Like that is big facts. Like it's like okay, great. Then don't follow me. Then that's what I want. Right. Go follow a ballet dancer. Okay. Go follow. Go follow a girl. modern okay. dancer or something. Shit. Go to Goodbye. a different so country. I don't feel the need to respond to. That's great. Yeah. Now you vibrate so high. Now when it comes, I have come a long way. Mm-hmm. Now when it comes to, <laughs> I have not always been the same. <laughs> Come along. God way. Been working on me. God right. Been working. Okay. But, but now when it comes to when it comes to positivity, I really try to have conversations with people. Yes. Because I I love the support and I appreciate the support. But when I really get down to it, I'm like, you guys, you guys like pay for my life, basically. When you really think about it, your support They've invested your so support much. Means the pays my bills. Like when you really truly think about that, like Absolutely. it's crazy. Absolutely. It's crazy to think about damn. So mm. all of these people that follow you, all of these people that like these videos or share your videos, Commenting they're literally videos. they're literally funding, funding your life. Like yeah. I don't think there's any amount there, there's nothing that I can do to show keep doing what you're doing. Show, you gotta yeah, keep yeah. Exactly that's all that you can do. It's stay and, you. Hell yeah. And just keep giving them giving them a reason to giving them a reason to just be invested in you. And sometimes I and I think I love thing, that. one thing I've learned is sometimes that's not all about dance. Like no. and, and one thing I need to time. what I, I, I need to get better at doing is like going on live and just like talking to you guys. Like going on live and just having a conversation with you. You I guys know that. I can dance. I fucking you know, love that too. Sing, you know, so it's And like, that's what this that's what this platform is. That's what after class is. Like af- yeah. what's happening after, after class? class? Who's Jazz Ari right. and Aaliyah after class? We see you Off can of dance. the dance floor. Yeah, right. we see all that. Okay, yeah. great. What else what else is there to you? Yeah. You know okay. what I mean? Exactly. What else is there? Who am I following? Yeah. A lot. Yeah. Who am I following? And that's what this that's what this platform is. And I that's that's literally what our goal is. Every single episode is for you to get to know us every single time. Yeah. You know what I mean? Every yeah. every um topic that we talk about, that's getting to know another layer yeah. of all of us. What's and our you friendship. Want them to know about you? Huh? What's something you want them to know? Something I want them to know, that I don't have a lot of friends. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm very, I, 
Damn, like I was thinking about, okay, yeah, my birthday's coming up, October 16th, bitch, put in your calendar. They said, we know, bitch, we know, we ready, bitch. We got this, we got this edit on deck. We got this edit on deck for your birthday. No, um, October 16th is my birthday, but I was like, damn, what do I want to do like with my friends? And I was like, okay, who are the friends that I care to be there? Especially my wedding as well. Who are the friends, who are the queens that I want to be there? And there's only a handful. Yeah, I was like, okay. damn. Yeah, I was like, I, like I almost... And people are like, wait, but your your wedding, you and Tally's wedding is gonna be like 300 people. I said, no, I quite the opposite. <laughs> 60, and I would rather have it that yeah, way. Yeah, because okay. it I would rather have it that way. way. It should be that way. The okay. second thing that um, I want people to know is that I'm very simple now. I'm a very simple person. And even if it may not seem like it on social media and it's like, we want the bougie boo stuff. We we'll go out to dinner, nails like this, hair like this. I just be getting it. Posting my picture, showing y'all, and going straight home. Oh, eat and go to sleep. Eat and go to sleep. I eat, eat man. Go to sleep. Eat, go to sleep. Okay. I'm a very simple person. Like it doesn't, okay. and and okay. and I'm very open. You know what I mean? People are so intimidated to come up to us and say hi if they recognize mm -hmm. us on the street and all of that. People are so intimidated, mm -hmm. and y'all just have to understand that we are people just like y'all. So we are. We're we simple. Got just like we're you simple. Know. You disrespect Ooh. us. Talk about problems. problems. We got problems just okay. like y'all. Okay. Problem, yeah. Real so life. we're human. <laughs> what do y'all want? What do y'all want the people to know about y'all that um, they may not know? I think people. I'm a very sensitive person. Mm, um, that's that's a good one. I'm a very, that's a good one, I'm sis. I'm a very emo people. People like look emotional. At me, which I'm a very strong. Person. Yeah, you look like like I'm a very put together. I could, my whole world could be crashing and you could and think you that my entire life is just perfect. Um, but I'm a very, I'm a very sensitive, emotional being. And I feel like people don't, people don't Simple, see sensitive. That. Yeah. You gotta think of an S word, people bitch. Don't, right, right. <laughs> Shitty. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my! Wait, can I say something? <laughs> you was about to say that? I'm sitting here like I have to poop. I have to poop. <laughs> <laughs> Shitty, right. <laughs> The next episode. No, I'm gonna tell y'all right now. Okay. Okay. What? What is what? it? No, but finish. No, I, it's just, <laughs> I asked the question because like, we were really trying to let these motherfuckers know what's up. I'm gonna look after. You can hold up. Squeeze, bitch. I am squeeze. Like, I'm like, I'm like, she's like this light. Usually, I'm like this on the couch. Today, we're keep it close. Right. Just in case something keep comes out. Cute. Keep it cute. Keep okay. Cute. Okay. Keep it cute. Oh, oh shit! God. That's gonna be this our. That's I gonna know. be the teaser. You read my motherfucking mind. <laughs> shitty. Shitty. Yes. That's the ass that you feel. I mean, if you feel. was pooty. Oh, oh my god. Okay, so. god. okay, take it away. Simple, sensitive, and I mean, sensitive was gonna be mine because I don't give that off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. People who know me. Too. Yeah. When she and I talk, we'd be like, <gasps> our life is in shambles. <laughs> I'm like, but we're good. I have Boo Boo ugly cried on Aaliyah's couch twice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and every time I'm just like, sorry, bitch. Mm -hmm. Not because we're human. No, mm -hmm. for real. But um, I don't know. I feel like I show a lot of my personality, but the, the sides that I don't show mm -hmm. is very emotional, very, I'm a huge empath. Oh my God, I feel and I take on mm -hmm. everything. I will stop my world mm -hmm. to cater to those around me. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I'm, I'm very giving, I'm very sensitive. I feel a lot. And giving. I like, say giving. Yeah, I Jazz is too. so She's giving. She will take care for you. She rise for you. She freaking rise for yeah. you. Whore. Yeah. Whore. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I have my moments. Like, I feel like people, all three of us, look at our social media and they're like, 
I get compliments all the time. Your life is so lit. You look like you're smiling. You're so happy, bitch. Let me tell you. Let sometimes you. Mm-hmm. I put this makeup on, post this video. And it's like makeup is off. off. I'm back in yeah. my bed. But Don't talk to me. I'm fucking sad. Yeah, that's how I be, babe. That, that's, that's how I be. That's the other side of this social media glimmer glamour. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. people, like, people don't realize. The fact that they do pay our bills. Yeah, I do still have to post and cater. And then once my real life kicks in and it's those times, mm. it's just like. Where it's like Jesus Christ. I cannot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I cannot do this video. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then, then when y'all be asked, someone asked me today, like, you ain't been TikToking. And I was so just going to be like, I'm it. on it, queen. And I was straight up, like, my life is I've been feeling shit. it. Yeah. yeah. A yeah. bitch is going the fuck through. And that's what I appreciate, too. Like, I try to go on live and I try to talk about that a little bit more. Mm-hmm. And be open about my struggles to, to yeah. a T. I like to keep my shit. Cause there's a lot of our lives is out there. But there's some yeah. things I keep to myself. Yes. Mm-hmm. But... Yeah, the emotions, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I mean, yeah. going through. And that's why people, and that that brings me back to what we were just talking about when it comes to negative comments. Like, people don't realize when it comes to the, these celebrities, when it comes to, to whomever is in the public eye, like, they're human beings. Okay? Behind the scenes it like, hurts. they're human beings. And, and one of these days, I'm not even gonna say one of these days because I know it's happened, but. People, trolls on social media, like, are, are going to cause people to end their life. And that's real shit. Like, people, you don't know, you don't know what, who, just because they got money and they got a Gucci bag and they got a Louis bag and they're, they're dating a ball player or they're, whatever the case, or they're a ball player, they still have problems. Mm-hmm. Y'all got me and Aaliyah drinking protein exactly. shakes. Okay. I'm on exactly. this motherfucking y'all herbal life. Y'all said, protein shakes y'all said y'all she's pregnant. Yeah. And it's, like, it's my depression. It's my thing. I'm eating. I'm fucking sad. So I like, guess now so I'll drink watch. this shake to make you happy. Yeah. So just And it makes me poop. Like, so fuck y'all. Exactly. Over here got a shit because y'all noticed my, my depression my, weight. <laughs> Bitch. I want a McDonald's. <laughs> But no, I hate Herbalife. it. <laughs> I'm done. Y'all, be kind to one another, yeah. please. Be kind to one another. If y'all got nothing kind to say, just don't say it at all. Just don't say it text at it all. To your friends, bro. Yeah, text, talk, talk shit. Talk, talk, talk shit behind, behind the scenes where nobody hears it, hear it, and say they suck. Okay, okay. send it in the group chat. Yeah, bitch, keep, it clean. Like, keep it clean. Keep it clean. Talk shit behind yeah. the door. Please. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't gotta let the world know. But anyway, anyway, so that's a that's a good um, way to end it off, y'all. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for the conversation. Thank y'all for listening and watching. Remember, oh, yeah. if you guys go on Full Out TV, you know you guys can get a cute little discount for us. I mean, from us if you type in after class, you know, get your training in, and we'll see y'all for the next episode. Yee. Thanks for listening. We love y'all.